Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Aussie Farming in the Philippines. Well, I'm back onto the corn cracker. Now, I've put it through one load, through um, one setting, and I've just moved it to another setting that I have marked, and then it comes out nice and powdery. So what I've done, to do a test, right, this is, go up under here, right, oh, go up under here, this is still all the, all the rough stuff, because I'm just doing a test at the moment, but behind here, is all the beautiful powder that chicken needs. So what I've done, is I've just done a test here. So I put this down into here like this. Oh. Okay. Oh. I put this just like this, just to give it a test through. And I put the corn in through, and all the powder went behind, of course, and all the rough stuff went to the front. And I, it worked. It worked no problems at all. So I thought, right, so let's make up a proper a proper shoot for this where the rough stuff can go out one end and the powder can go down the other. So that's what I'm going to do. Now to do that, I'm going to have to extend the legs on this and bring this up higher so that I can feed it with um, the two shoots underneath. I've got enough wood over here and I've got ply over here that I can make up the shoots so that this can come down, run through a screen, and then come out, there's um, the rough stuff I can put through again. So I've got some steel that I left over from the gate. I want to weld it up the gate when Bob was here, Bob the welder. So what I'm going to do, is I'm gonna add legs onto this, and I'm gonna make up a shoot, a shit, a shit shoot, a shit shoot. Wow. So it will work, I'm pretty sure of it. Hmm. Because I'm trying to work out how, when I come in here this morning, I thought, look at all the, all the mess that's here. I've got to give this a blowout. And I thought, well, I'll take the corn first, and it's low. I thought, well, how about I do some corn, a couple of sacks of corn first, and then I'll get in and give it a good pressure clean blowout and all that shit. But now I've changed direction, and I'm thinking, let's get this bitch worked out. I've been thinking about it for a long time. Long, long time. And this works absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. Perfect for what chick needs. All right. Let's stop talking, let's start working. We'll come back when I finish. Right. No, it's not finished yet, so don't complain yet. Right, so I've just put the legs onto it. I've got more welding to do on those. Um, I've got an old bin here, which is gonna be the chute. Now what I've done, what I wanna do, is put a piece of wire down in here, so that the rough stuff will come out of chute on the front here, I'll cut a hole in here, the rough stuff will come out there, and the powder will come down the back. Now I've just put a bit of wire in here now, I've just cut up with a bit of scissors, to see the test, this was on an angle, it's just collapsed in now. But, but saying that, saying that, yes, it worked. Yes, look at that. Look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that. Look, oh, look at that. So what I'll do is I'll put a chute directly under this. So this comes out onto an angle here into a bucket. And the front will actually come out on the front here, I'll cut a hole and put a chute there. The rough can come out. And that netting will go from the back here to the bottom here. And it will be okay. But it's working by George. By George, I think it's working. Right, so where are we up to? Right. So this is the box. This is the box. This is the chute for the powder to come out. This will go up under here like so. The chute there will come out through there. Now, I've made... Where is it? Here. Sit down. Sit down. Right, so this one here, this is your screen. It's removable. So I can, this will go in here like so. Okay, so all the powder will go down into the back. All the heavy stuff will go out the front. So all I have to do now is put another one on the front. Another chute on the front here. Put a chute there. A chute on the front. So I'm gonna put another one here. Now, if that doesn't flow out too good, what I'll end up doing is I'll put a complete chute on the side where that's all cut out all the way along here. But I'm hoping that the three inch will actually work on that side of things. So that's where we're up to at the moment, guys. And I think it's gonna bloody work, mate. I tell you, bloke, you're gonna be bloody flashy than Michael Jackson, matey. Right, guys, so the next stage is We've got the bottom one on, and we use the heat glue gun to stick it all together. Okay, which is all around here. This is nice and firm. And now, this is that's for the um, dust chute for chicks 
hammered corn to come out through the back and on the front will be the crack corn. corn so the way we do it is this little tool here there this little tool from bob the builder bob the builder voila oh, wow. and i tell you fantastic and if you look at this just a marking this is how we do this one it's quite easy quite simple to do And yes, Bob, it is on it is on one ten volt. Don't worry, it is on one ten. <laughs> <laughs> right, so all done. Balancing act. So all the tops done. So I'll let this dry for an hour or so, and then I'll upend it the other way and put it on the bottom area. But the old the old glue gun works very well, guys. Heat gun works well. I think it's going to work. Right, guys, finished. So this is what it's going to look like. And I think it should work. There's no reason why it doesn't work. So everything's at a nice angle. There's no um, sharp angles, it's a nice slope. So um, what I'll have to do is just get some corn out and um, give it a test and I'll be back. But I think it's gonna work. Save me a lot of time, this will. If I save time, that means I save electricity. Save electricity, you save peso. Gotta be happy. Okay. Let's see if it works or it doesn't. So all I need to do, pick up these earmuffs. Right, so all I need to do later, is I'm gonna make a tray up here where I can just manually, slowly just push it in. But um, it worked. It worked, it bloody worked. All right, gotta be happy with that. All right guys, we're gonna catch you all later on. I've got a lot of grinding up to do before we go tomorrow into the vow. So get stuck into this bitch and let's do it. Yeehaw.